can we just have a moment of silence for my afro guys please like i even have a comb just to keep combing him during the recording because oh my and god it keeps, like, it keeps shrinking like it's moist it, yes it keeps shrinking but like it's so alive and my hair's so healthy and oh just a moment of silence jesus <laughs> anyway let's go let's okay. let's do this movie and me and taya back with another movie review finally um we are reviewing citation which is a which is a nigerian film directed by kunde afolayan oh god and the starring it's starting temi or to that oh my god no we're gonna have to have, which is um Muremi, the main character woman right jimmy since he speaks french i'm assuming the last name is pronounced jean louis Ini Edon, the list goes on and on and on, but like Ini, I've loved that woman since like when I first started watching Nigerian movies, when Africa Magic became a thing on DSTV. Like, you oh my God. You brought me into back into Nigerian movies and I was like, I give up. Every movie is a minimal two hours. You were just like, girl, stories though. I was like, okay. Exactly. Okay. There's some that last the whole day, five hour movies. Oh my God. I live for them. I live for them. What was your first moment of, okay, what's this or oh i have direction now first of all i wanted to snatch that tyler perry wig off that man's head <laughs> like, girl, girl. He's, he's a good looking man like he, this character makes him look really ugly from the inside but he's a very good looking man girl. and he usually is bold and then that tyler Did you perry see that on the side where you could, you could see you can see here above his, was ear, right? his skin and then the wig started like <laughs> <laughs> it was just like who why what where what in the fall from grace is happening i didn't i didn't get it are we supposed to just hate him automatically because that's what they're trying to do it's just like this guy is the villain look at that nasty hair done done <laughs> listen no, yeah my first yeah. thing, you remember the first scene is a previous incident that leads us to to the story. at the same university yes the first thing that i thought was this university in their forum they got to be trifling or something exactly. telling, telling the 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 previous the the flash telling us the flashback of the previous incident and then t- um basically telling us that those people that were trying to take action because some of these forums actually do nothing it just like it gave me such a sinking feeling in my heart that where are we going with this story exactly. you know is this going to be a happy ending or we're going to have to be like we are bending these schools now <laughs> I, I don't know how I felt about that first scene. That I guess scene. it's it's true. Yeah, I guess it's true in that society does tend to villainize the victims of sexual assault. And that's yeah. what I thought they were doing. Yes, I think that's what they were trying to give us the view that not all the incidents that are reported will end in a happy ending, if you know what I mean. So mm-hmm. I think it was cool because it maybe just be like, you know, for for main girl like root for her even harder like y'all you cannot go through what that other girl went through you know for actually trying to take action because these forums generally don't work. That girl with the with the and the beautiful um, skirts she has stunning wardrobe throughout actually, the entire movie. All of them throughout the movie the yeah, jackets yeah. there's always an accent of like. A print nyana, very colorful. I, I very, like very it. dope. I think we should take that on and just like on a daily basis have like an African print thing coming out your wardrobe, right? Girl, they're all speaking French together. I think that shit bothered me so much. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. Why? I felt like they didn't have to do that because that thing of them having their own thing irritated me because it created a cocoon for them and i i mean i didn't i didn't quite see why they just couldn't speak the other language and now suddenly the friendship is not only bound by i'm a teacher how to drive a stick shift and we're gonna speak in french like no no guys just let them speak in what language are they speaking there? <laughs> 
English, Yoruba, but again, I would, like like I made I went and I read some reviews. Apparently, even the Yoruba that was shady. Our pick is was yeah was was under the tree. <laughs> was shady. And you were saying, what was it like for you? You didn't see it as a bother at all. No, not at all. I think it 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 meant to serve the purpose that it was intended. That it was a way to for him to isolate her from everybody else. Or hey, you've got a Spidey T-shirt. Oh, let me see the the T-shirt you've got on on your hand. But no, no, no. It's a it's oh, a brace. My bad, my bad. At the L Z, <laughs> like oh my girl got superpowers. <laughs> okay. Unfortunately, um, not. her suitor who isn't her boyfriend yet, while. Well, She's busy giving free lessons of car driving. The med student. Fam, can I just say, the first time they introduce him, that guy is outside lurking outside her class with his lab coat and a stethoscope. Who does that? Who, what, like, I was so confused as to this doctor left his practice with him. <laughs> because he does. <laughs> because I don't know he who does. he was. He looks like he should not be near students. He looks right? like he should be in his he own practice. Little girl, no. Students need to tell us, like, is that how y'all walk around with your stethoscopes? Just Please. like... Just like, <laughs> fine. He's a medical student, fine. But that's officially his name throughout the whole movie for me, med student guy. <laughs> <laughs> they were doing a good job of juxtaposing how a man should treat you as to oppose how this monster... <laughs> Like they, they made, I, it was the intention of the movie. They made Professor Ndiari look bad. It was so boring for, for them to try to just oppose it like that to make him suit her boyfriend who she clearly was not interested in. The entire movie, she hugs this guy maybe twice or three times and she doesn't even kiss him. Does she kiss him on the cheek and let's see at the birthday party? Which, yes, when she's like, and she's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, like she clearly is not interested in Umed's student. And I'm just like, so he's supposed to be the good guy. And if they are trying to do the whole good guy gets the girl or wins, this was a terrible way to do it. And I think it was kind of forced to even make him a med student. So now we are saying our daughters must grow up to look for doctors and not like look at like academics because academia doesn't pay judging by the car of the professor <laughs> okay i see what they were going like i see what they were intending they to tried do. but if they the tried. girl at least was like trying to feel umis that would be like gosh and he's a winner but he was boring as the almost the entire movie almost <laughs> i leave the parts where he was not boring for later Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Well, also the clear setup of him being into karate. It was really. Of, I, I like that. I like that. Yeah. Like they, that. they set it up. They, it was set up. Yeah. It's were like if you were following, you were like, yeah, this is gonna come back, isn't it? Yes. He's a good guy. He's even teaching you self defense. Like you him. know, pick him. Choose him. If I liked it or not, but that whole stay away from the professor. I don't like you being around him like that. Who said that? Oh, was... yes, when he was jelly after he saw her doing the lesson. Yes. Stuff. I was like, how dare you? <laughs> how dare you be possessive? How dare you? <laughs> there's, a, there's a point that I just read here that says, med student in ninja training. Why didn't she take my lesson? <laughs> I like that the instructor was actually talking what uh, was talking I, I want to say Japanese what? I say, he was speaking Asian <laughs> <laughs> he spoke a foreign language yes the one that karate is you know from because yes. that's another contentious, you know. So the friend, the friend, the female friend. Girl, I'm about to get to her too. Ooh. But I wanted to slap her so bad. <laughs> are, you, are you at the scene where I think they were getting ready for her birthday party and tell, he's telling her to get, she's telling her to get dressed or whatever. 
And she's just basically saying, baby girl, like I can see prof is looking at you and you're not interested. So hook me up because prof is my kind of man. And I'm just there like, okay, really. In her spitefulness, she purposefully gave false evidence during this. Um, oh, I wanted to. Mm. Exactly. Like, what are we saying? She's in the friend group. She's the only female. And in this friend group, she is the only one that does not stand by her friend. But knowing. Let's, let's be real. It, it, I think for me, it's established in that scene where they're getting ready for her birthday party that these two are not friends. They are colleagues of, of the education. Because, I mean, as a friend, that you'd never do that. You'd never, um, first, just force me to hook you up with someone. And if you can see this person is looking at me. Now I must go and be like, oh, also, that was into you. Cool, I can do that. But like, if he's not into you, what must happen? What, what magic wand must I read now? Like, it was just such a useless, like, relationship for me. But I got her role was to be the girl who's just very forward, like, are you married? Do you have kids? Because I'm, you know, and I was just like, oh, I want you. I need you. And to further press, Uguti, this professor is a bad guy. All he wants is to show his dominance over someone. So having someone who's so forward and says, take me, me, I'm yours. Not attractive to him at all. No. At all. Can we just talk about the twins quickly? Can we not? <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Um, was there two people? Were there two people in the movie that were so useless? Yes. Were they twins? Yes. Were they hyperactive and physically almost abusive at some point? Yes. Those twins irritated the crap out of me every time they showed up. Were they supposed to be comic relief? Because they were so out of place, like so mm. not. There's a serious scene. This girl is running. She's trying ooh. to get to, and there they are looking. And there they are. Like, you know, being she really could have fallen. Cranky. They could have slowed her down that way. She could have her books could have fallen something, but they had to bring in the twins. I guess I guess the twins were um, Team Remy. They were they are, her uh, like a physical hashtag. Like, those twins. They were so tonally, tonally in a different film. Tone like just no. unacceptable. Listen, something that I enjoyed in the movie was uh, the um, class discussions. That that stuff they were discussing made me want to go study in Nigeria. Like these guys, I mean, they are here. I mean, African I mean, politics, like dude. And they were discussing things. I was just like, hey, hey, now made me want to go read up on something. I I really did enjoy. They show, showcased um, the quality of their education, I think, really well. And it made me just maybe want to study further. <laughs> Go study. <laughs> Go study. Do an undergrad in political young, studies. The young masters there, you know. <laughs> just, just one or two. So I can also be like, I have two masters. Oh, so. girl, this earring. <laughs> it don't want. That's fine, I'll put it down. Okay, wait. So we get to the live performance um, at the at the birthday party. <gasps> that was so fun. That stuff reminded me of how bad lockdown is, guys. Like, I was having you so know. much normal watching them have fun with that, uh, uh, that, I don't know what his name was, but he was a cootie. That was his surname, the guy performing, mm -hmm. which went down the Fela Fela. Fela son. Is, in, is he Fela's son? No, he's not what his son, means? but he's like a distant relative because they talk about yeah he's the line at some point and i was just like oh, i want to go to a live show i want to dance i want to be in the middle of sweaty people this is strike music <laughs> it was so cool have i ever liked like being no because of toilets i don't like going to like places where i, I might have to go to a public toilet it's just um there's a cost to everything, so it's unfortunate. Can't have it all. Some of us just like but that. Look like fun. 
it was so much then fun. i just remembered like the last time i was out at a place like that i think i was with you and who was on stage what streets were you at because we're always in the streets sometimes when are okay so what i'm trying to say about the tournament and um med students karate tournament and uh her fighting for her life in court it's a really nice uh, is it just just the position when you like put yes, on this right i don't know what what was just the position like when you have two opposing yeah but um, these aren't opposing these are sort of parallel of the same thing because they're basically saying she's fighting it's for her life it's just the position yeah cuz it is two different it's some things. kind of position you know <laughs> <laughs> okay can we talk about mr cardoza when he came to the hearing and his skin looking like he was bitten by crocodile like he swam from senegal to nigeria what was going on with that sunburn did he do a life of pie between senegal to nigeria? like what's going on bro like oh. i was confused because i was like wait that's the same dude that she was talking to right in senegal and why does it bad but yay when you see for the hearing it was like from bad to worse <laughs> it's like why why i don't know <sighs> i don't there must have been an uh, an artistic reason do you think they're trying to show us that he's poor because he spoke about his poverty and him taking the blood money from that guy um, black people are poor but we still know how to exfoliate ka paslapa <laughs> this is nonsense we must still be talking about the saying how poor people well not poor yeah poor people who go in on how good they want to look because you can't be poor and ugly guys you need to pick a struggle you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying struggle <laughs> these, these, these uh people that work in what we call low end jobs or whatever they be out here with the lashes and the makeup and the hair did all the time and so don't smell it good you move you were trying to tell us that poor people have bad skin ah oh that's <laughs> <good. laughs> <laughs> like that oh yes when she took out her ripped panties and she says imagine this was your sister imagine oh, your this daughter, was your daughter right that's also so something that oh irks my spirit it's like why do you have to imagine that the person the victim is related to you in any way on a human level just someone being, being violated right. exactly. Point. Exactly. Point. exactly just exactly. point why do we have to imagine people that because we know because, because people only take things and make things important if they if it affects them personally so human I, condition i get what she was trying to do but yes it should not be something that we have to do to get our point across mm-hmm. did you see karate guy acting like a bodyguard there just like back up back up i was like oh <laughs> the twins hugging each other <laughs> they were so like the twins <laughs> oh, I'm, oh, okay. i'm okay um but yeah oh, 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 my students he came through man his karate was put to work there he was there like first month <laughs> his back before you are annihilated <laughs> I love that. I love that. I also loved when she came back to class uh when the old old professor with 17 PhD. Yeah, that was so dope. I was just like, "Oh, mm, girl." It was nice. It was and her nice. friend was like, mm. "Oof." I was just like, "Me fancy black it's in." You know. Oh, oh. Yeah, I I really loved that that last scene. It was really nice. It gave me the high that I was so desperately seeking from a 6-hour movie. of uh, mm. of really strange. especially how i mean the first the the first incident Story of ended. sexual harassment yeah. with you know? yeah. the movie score it out of uh, 10 for us out of 10 i could score it a 7 you know i really enjoyed the 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 the, the, the break in the whole movie that they gave us for for a concert <laughs> yes i really yes. i really loved it yeah the story uh, they didn't they didn't keep the story heavy the entire time yeah oh yes and there's also a bbc africa documentary available on youtube it's called sex for grades yeah very eye opening yes 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 check that out oh it's my god it's intense right it's very it's intense it's yeah. it's intense 
it's, like it's, I knew things like this happened, but it's so some lectures are so brazen. So be because forward. these forums that they have at these universities do not work, and they don't. Mm-hmm. This is this is the sad part. You have the forums at the universities that don't work, and then you go to the cops, and the cops are, and the cops. I don't the cops. <sighs> You know what I mean? Oh, God. So oh, it's just, God. where do we run to as victims of this sexual harassment and stuff? So it's 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 sad. Please suggest the next movie for us because there is so much content now. I'm so, I don't know what, what we want to do, but I want to do something fun, something light. Let us know. Let us know because Citation was suggested yes. by a viewer. You know who you is, Ipile. You know who you is. <laughs> Yeah, yeah.